Hey everybody, welcome to Morning Inspiration in School in a Pandemic. And let me just say what a blessing today is. So we have a professional development day. And um, if this is your first time joining, this is my chronicle of what it's like of going back um, to school in person as my school has been completely virtual and now we're here on a hybrid model. And I basically just share how God encourages me during this time and also um, educator tips. And I'm telling you, um, I'm loving today. So today we have professional development. And it's from the house. <laughs> Very excited about that. And um, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm feeling pretty good about it. So um, yeah. Yeah, that's that's been it. I don't have anything else to say other than um very thankful to God for this opportunity uh, to sleep in just a little bit later. Um, I usually get up so early and y'all be up with me, <laughs> but I'm so very thankful uh, for this day. Um, the scripture for today is comes out of Matthew, and it's Matthew four, and it basically says um, it's. Jesus and he's talking to uh, his disciples and he's calling them and I find it interesting that when he called them they just went as a matter of fact um, before he called them he met their needs and you know I'm reminded of Peter as he was out with the other fishermen and they were fishing um, and they weren't catching anything there was nothing in their nets and so Jesus told them to cast their nets out again and they were like you know they didn't catch anything and he's like um, you know, basically told them to put the nets out there again. And they put their nets out there and they caught so much that the nets were breaking. And when he asked them to follow him, they immediately went and followed him. And, you know, it just really blew my mind because how many of us, God is calling us to follow, but because of fear or because of doubt, we won't get out there and do it. And so I just want to encourage us today um, to continue to seek out that purpose and really answer the call that God has on your life. You know, um, step out there. It can feel scary. Um, and that's really been on my spirit lately. But I'm just saying, <laughs> when you step into your purpose, um, you will be in the place where God will have you. You will be uh, more fulfilled. Um, no, it will not be easy. <laughs> I'm not going to say you can ask Peter and the disciples about that. It won't be easy. But um, when you're doing the thing he's called you to do, there will be so much more fulfillment in that. And so I'm um, just calling you guys, just asking you guys to go ahead and step out. Don't be fearful. I pray that this is confirmation for you. And um, let's go to God in prayer. God, we thank you so much for this day. We thank you that you call us by name. We thank you that we are your workmanship. We thank you that you predestined us. We thank you that you loved us. We thank you that you know the plans that you have for us, plans to prosper us, not to harm us, but give us hope and a future. And God, I'm just so chilled out this morning. I thank you for this extra time, Lord God. And God, I look forward to this um, uh, professional development. I pray for my brothers and sisters who have job interviews today. I pray for those of us who um, have new businesses or uh, uh, introducing new products, those of us who are branding agents, those of us who are just oh, musicians and homemakers and educators. God, just be with us on today. Whatever your occupation, put it in God's hands and allow him to work your purpose, Lord, in the place that he has for you. And God, we just take this time to also pray for those who do not know you. I pray that they will understand that the only thing that they need to do is know that if they will believe that your son, Jesus Christ, died on the cross for their sins and rose on the third day, they are saved. And I welcome you to the body of Christ. And if you are somebody who is, you know, at this point, you're not really sure about this Jesus Christ thing. Hey, please know I understand. My stomach growling. Please know I understand. Uh, but know that he is standing right there waiting um, to receive you. In Jesus name. Amen. Amen, y'all. Oh, I am so mellowed out. This is crazy. I'm so mellowed out. Um, so, yeah, I'm getting ready to go in there for, to the in-service. And um, 
uh, this virtual and I hope that you guys have a wonderful and blessed weekend and I'll see you later.